Shorter instruction periods, changes in electives, and the impact on in-depth learning. Those are some of the concerns Austin ISD parents expressed to KXAN about proposed changes to move from block scheduling, which is eight classes divided into four class A and B days, to seven shorter classes students would attend every day. The district says the move would help in saving about $21 million and also help with staffing shortages by requiring fewer teachers. Well, I understand that. Budgets are budgets. But at the same time, you, you do wonder, you know, aren't there less direct to the student impact things that we could alter? I would say that Kelly Ruxer, AISD mom of three, says she wants to ensure teachers have adequate planning time. This after seeing the district propose teachers teach six of seven periods a day with an extra hour on Wednesdays for additional planning time. For her students, she says their current block schedule is critical. Especially at the high school level, simply because at the collegiate level, they're functioning on a block schedule, and I think it prepares them. We took those concerns to the district, which sent us seven priorities for next year as school officials review calendar options. Those include maintaining a version of a block schedule, providing multiple elective opportunities, and creating equitable embedded planning time for all teachers. A spokesperson says principals are currently reviewing scheduling options that would be best for students. In Austin, Jennifer Sanders, KXAN News. A district spokesperson tells us other priorities as they review calendar options include proposing a balanced budget, identifying ways to reduce central office positions, and evaluating staff salary concerns. Any proposed changes would be an administrative decision since the Board of Trustees does not vote on schedules. The district says it's working on getting more details ironed out so they did not provide a timeline about any of these decisions. Also happening right now at Austin ISD, the district's giving updates on canvases closed for repurposing. In November 2019, the district voted to close Metz, Pease, Sims, and Brook Elementary Schools. And then the pandemic hit and priorities, of course, changed. But the district still has plans for those campuses. Those schools were targeted for reasons including how much it would cost to modernize them. Shrinking class sizes in areas were also forcing consolidation. We are following tonight's meeting and we will have updates on KXAN.com.